Hello everyone and welcome back. So I'm going to be kind of going back and forth with the uh, webcam deal because I'm going to be uh, in Colorado here Sunday, so like two days from now, and then from like, what is it, the 10th to I think the 6th of September, I'm not going to be in the great state of Alabama, so I won't have most of my setup and everything, but I'm still going to be uploading this channel. Anyways, thank you for joining me today. If you are new here, then awesome. If you're not new here, then I still appreciate all the support on this channel. It's been awesome to kind of, you know, receive support. <laughs> I do appreciate it. So we are continuing on with our playthrough of Alone in the Dark. Uh, we're getting alcohol because, of course, I don't know, let me fix my chair momentarily. Yeah, that's probably about right. Okay. Oh, man. Actually, now I feel like I'm sitting too low for this microphone. There we go. Okay. That's that's probably good. Hopefully my mic doesn't suck. I had to take my normal mic and change it out. This one is a bit strange right now, but that's eh, all right. So what are we doing right this moment? Uh, archive. Don't know what that is. Uh, Another world. Talisman has shown me the gate that will Was open in the dining room. Was this a of that mysterious terraway? Don't know. Could be. All right, let's see here. How do we get to the dining room? There's the drawing room. Uh, dining room looks locked. 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 Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm guessing. That ain't it. That's to the conservatory. This is it. So, it's bolted. Did I get a new key? I must have. How do I see what's in my... Well, I don't know. Let's go see. It says bolted, right? Yeah, uh, bolted door. Okay, so it's bolted. Can't get through there. However, there is a locked door in the stairwell. So I think if I go upstairs one more... Oops. Yeah, I should be able to get to the mezzanine. Basically, just a long way around a bunch of nonsense. Is this the right way? This is, in fact, the right way. Probably. It's probably the right way. To be honest with you, I don't really know which way is the right way. To be honest with you, Diane. I think I have the key to get downstairs. Haha, <laughs> unless. Ah, one's open now. Sensational. Where's the portal? Here we go. Wait, where, where are we going? What are you talking no, about? Uh, there's more of that aggressive. Give me that fire poker. On the common I'm going to stop you there. On the commonplace of evil, there lies virtue in stark irreverence, careless thoughts of luminous indifference. But blame not the beast we once were, which science so often wish to refer. Oh, God, they're rhyming. Uh, not the wicked full of sin. It is you who stand and grin. All our good intentions aside, whereupon we build our pride. Sunless solitude, follow not this corrupting light. Prophets of confidence always crashes out of sight. Hear me, for we all bear this mark. Thus we must remain alone in the dark. Nor a key. Truly, one of the poets of our time. The door has been unbroken. Okay. What was the point of any of that? The talisman has shown that the gate will open in the dining room. Has it, though? Did it really? Is that what it showed? Hmm. Maybe if I try to go out. Ha! That's right. Chapter 3. Random... Windagoon in the courtyard. <laughs> I 
I'm glad to see you made it. I had my doubts, oh, but the hope French. you instilled has yet abandoned me. I guess this must be Tarawea. Who are you? I mean, it's okay. My name is Juan Luis Jorge, and this is indeed the convent of Tarawea. You'll have to excuse me, but Jeremy never got your name. Jeremy? It's Jeremy. The name's Edward Carnby. I'm a private investigator. You're not a patient, are you? No. I'm the author of a book that Jeremy once found important. What? How does that work? Are you part of this memory as well? Is this even a memory? Could be. I think calling me a manifestation <coughs> of Jeremy's subconscious Excuse would me. be more correct. And so is the convent of Tarawea. Hmm. I'm a man Jeremy has never met. Oh, okay. And we are in a place that he has never been. Oh, sure. Okay. So are you here to guide me or something? No. I have no more purpose than you do. I simply am. I will happily help you, of course, if I'm able. If you are already somehow part of Jeremy, why did he want to come here? Isn't he sort of here already? No. Jeremy wanted to come here because it's a representation of his mind at peace. When Dr. Gray asks him to find his focus during his sessions, this far-flung convent is what Jeremy imagines. Okay. He is under the impression that if he could physically come here, he would reach a perfect equanimity. A spiritual apotheosis. You don't think it would work? Jeremy subconsciously Bro, knows it's just what That thinking. would not be very comfortable. He can't come here. Despite the pathways opened by the dark man between their seto and Jeremy's psyche, it's simply not possible. But I'm here. <laughs> Indeed. It's a shame it's just another place for you, detective. Otherwise, you could have become a Buddha. Always a bridesmaid, never a blushing bride. Am I right? <laughs> yes, I suppose so. You'll have to chase enlightenment elsewhere. So what's the next best thing? What can I do here? You should seek out the convent library and try to find the truth about Yermi's relationship with the Dark Man. It's the sort of knowledge he represses and He's is unable man. to reflect on. Calling it. Will it tell me how to break the pact? Perhaps. At least you'll have something to confront Yermi with. Wait. Get me. Why can't you just tell me? I don't know such things. You'd be better off consulting the text of Dr. Freud. Sigmund Freud? <laughs> <laughs> no thanks, I hate shrinks. There is another thing you should know about the library. He is here as well. The Dark Man? The Dark Man has been working his way through the text for a long, long time. He's here? How, do you guys speak How am I supposed to get past him? Be careful, detective. Oh, jeez. Just perfect. Okay. Guess we're done with our conversation. Yeah, I could talk to you further, but I just simply don't care. Hmm, yes. Okay. Yeah, let's go ahead and jump down. Ugh. Ugh. By the way, you know how bad it hurts to even fall just six feet and land on your feet? Not ideal. Hmm, yes, I see, I see. A dirty pool. Just had to make sure that like those things aren't gonna move. There's something missing. Looks like a cross of sorts. That means I need to find one of these guys who's got it. What you play now, brother? That thing, maybe. Hiding with your books? Okay. Hmm, yes. The Great Three. Library. The Great Library was endless, beautiful, and terrible. And Akashic? 
record, a Kazakh, Kaz, a Kazakh. Yeah, I think it's Kazakh. Not yes. <clears throat> record for the universe inside the mind of Jeremy Hartwood, now corrupted by a story forced upon him, told by a maniacal liar, an evil conjured by science and secrecy. I will suspend a room and lock away the foundation of his character. Its key will be left to the library, the only thing invisible to the prowler. What a statement is that? These guys are all going to get up at some point, by the way. I'm just saying. I think we all know what's going on. Hopefully there's not a bug in my headset. Nope, just my hair. Shoot. Oh, hey, what's this? Can I get there? Yes, I can. Nice. Unmasked evil with a mummified cat. Okay. I still don't really know what those are doing, but, you know. Why not? <laughs> Might as well add it to the collection. There's some nerd trying to read. Key of Hubertus. After this uh, suspended room was built, the key was given to the Covenant librarian Hubertus to keep Jeremy's darkest secrets safe. From the rat. caveman on it, apparently. It's not food. Oops. Oh, excuse me. Is that thing still out there? Or... I just want to point out something that I was burning to death regardless. Okay, I gotta go with that way. Is <laughs> it? Stay away from me, or I'll shoot myself. I should say that actually. Uh, that is uh, the game. That's what happens in the game, not IRL YouTube mods. So chill out.
we'll, we'll test this out one more time. And if uh, Prometheus right there is once again up here, then I guess I'm just gonna go to the exit. So there's time to turn that uh, now I can't do this. Dude, I swear, if you are okay, no. Let's see if I can go around you. Just drink through the pain, brother! You're fine! I'm out of brandy. <laughs> this is done. And that's that. This is that's that. sure why he can't jump over a small area like that, but huh. nobody ever said Carnby was an athlete. Maybe an athlete at best. Here's something. Here's something. Same. Here's the same locking mechanism I've used several times before. It was in the hot autumn that I went through the night with the restless crowd. It's Louisiana, it's always hot. It was a kind of itinerant showman who held forth in public halls and aroused widespread fear. The New Orleans address of the event is lost, but I remember distinctly the Prext shipping company pressing their contributions. What's up, brother? Hey. The sacred texts. <laughs> Sun. 
<laughs> Detective! One. One. Now take this thing away from me. I hope you found the jewel. I fear there is no hope. <laughs> I'm so sad. Start doing like tricep so workouts, close. buddy. There must be something I can work with. It's not. Come on, Garmy, think. Think. The shipping company. The shipping company. Prankst. Right. Good luck, detective. Thanks, Windigoon. Appreciate that, brother. But you're dead! And now you're alive. Oh, she's wearing a green dress. Well, thank this is her God sister. you're here, Detective. Sitting all alone in a place like this. I'd never live it down if the papers got wind of it. I don't think the papers care. Hey. Ruth, right? Oh, don't pretend you don't know. I'm sure you have a whole file on me by now, Detective. No. You're not really that important. I suppose we weren't formally introduced. I'm Ruth Talon. Miss Ruth Talon. In case you're wondering. Edward Carnby. Enchanté. And I wasn't watching. Or wondering. Enchanté! Ha ha! We're sure? French. I had too many already. Clearly. Nice. It's good. I know. I have great taste, detective. I heard you're trying to break Jeremy's promise to the dark man. Yeah, it's hip to get. Yeah. Do you know anything about that kind of stuff? No. Did you wonder? To the audio there, the promise, I have no clue. Can't he simply stand by his words? Look, I'm just trying to get Jeremy out of a bad deal, so he'll come back with us to New Orleans. Well, if all fails... What are you doing? <laughs> it's a sign of submission to the dark man. I saw it in a dream once. Don't do that. What? Ah, uh, she's just drunk. Let her go. You don't know the Pregst Shipping Company by any chance? I do. They made big money during the war. Which one? Their waterfront office is just over there. Oh, of course. How did you right do there. that? Very nice. Do what, detective? Do what? I'm just Bonjour. drinking in an alleyway. <laughs> this is where I was murdered, hey, don't you know? Have you seen Emily Hartwood anywhere? Not Are you, you trying to make me jealous, detective? <laughs> no, I haven't seen your doll anywhere. She just disappears off, oop, off into the, the fog. See you later. Look for the. Okay. Look for the address to the Dark Man's ship. Craig's shipping company. It's not a shipping company. The Dark Man is connected to a performance that Jeremy went to somewhere in New Orleans. Surely it's got. I'm sure, I can find the address inside. What's this? Absolutely nothing. The flyer title. It's locked from the other side. Always is, isn't it? Ah, yes, a brick for somebody's teeth. A brick for this guy's teeth. Welcome to the party, brother. Ah, oh, no! Maybe a mall topper hat. More stuff. Another mall topper hat. Oh, this guy. Here, come here. Another Molotov. Oh, okay. I am doing exceptional. Sensational. There's another guy. Luckily, I've got an entire ore. Come here, buddy. Time for sweet release of death. Oh. Ow. Sweet release. Oh. Oh. It's got 
going down there. And by sweet release, I mean sweet release of death, which is what happened to him. Ah, there's still so much more stuff here. Well, now I know it's here. Oh, it's locked, of course. Oh, yeah, there it is. Sledgehammer is by far superior to everything. Just drop down into this hidey hole. <clears throat> Kind of broken to me, but before I go back out there, nah, there. bro, how did you miss that? About a brick. Maybe. Oops, that's health. Okay, good. Yeah, you died. You're fine. Good work. We're proud of you. Also, now the door's open. The sewer system has a tunnel running right below Preg's shipping company. Oh, wow. I bet I can use it to get inside. Yeah, probably. Excuse me. Ah. Been a long day today. Just go right across here and see what all this is about. Typewriter ribbon. Neato. Another brick, perhaps. Yeah, that's good. You're gonna need to raise the crane, I believe. heard that, right? There he is. Oh, God. Oh. Listen. That's right. You jackass. Load. Perfect. Another one. Oh no, depression made another one. Okay, gates closed. Perfect. Why is it foggy down here? Well, it's the turds of New Orleans, of course. You move there. You got it, brother. Mm. Oh, yeah, that's gonna be funny. Step in. Mm. Think he's got anything? Sorry, so it's gonna get worse, I guess. Ooh, man. The encoder is like messing up. Frames per second dropping by the second. 
This has to be spiders, doesn't it? Mother of all that is holy on this planet. Are you serious, bro? Are you really doing that? Did you forget how to throw? I mean, did you forget how to throw? Come here. It's in here. Brick. Okay, well, uh. Let's we'll go ahead and drink that. That was horrible. Hmm. Nice spotlight <laughs> in the sewer. All right, made it inside the warehouse. The office must be upstairs. Must it? So I got two at least. I don't know why I just drank that other one, but now I'm at full health. So you know, happy little accidents. What's that? Is that a beaten stick? Fire bug there. I'll take it. I believe you, but my Tommy gun don't. Our ship was raided while in dock. All of his things were recovered, but blood was shed. Several men were carried into the Mississippi River and drowned by the ones who live in the deep. All items have been signed and delivered. Now best keep the paper safe. What is left later is right, and hell is back again. fire poker okay so mm-hmm uh, what is left later is right Comes back again. so it's like left right left I'm pretty sure but we need to find numbers for that haha unless, <laughs> unless. Don't know. Don't have enough information. Usually there's crap on the walls or something.
Your map is of no use here. Great. That's what I was hoping for. Let's see if we can go out this way. Not hardly. I know that's a puzzle. The question is, why? What kind of puzzle is it? I'm not seeing anything that would tell me what to do there. It's left, right, left. Oh, see those uppers. Hmm. <sighs> <sighs> Nothing there. Nothing on his desk. Nothing on the safe. Yeah, I see nothing. Nothing here is giving me any clues as to what that safe may be. Wait, anything written on the roof? That's the only place I need to check. Let's go back down into the sewers. Maybe that'll trigger something that happened? I have no idea. Check my stuff. Pier 11. The Great Library. For my objectives. Somehow, Combe was back in New Orleans, close to the docks. He, he could, could smell, smell the pungent of the Mississippi River. In He's front of him in was the Prext Shipping Company. According to the book in the library, he should find the address to where Jeremy first met the dark man inside. It's very unhelpful, thank you. It's gotta be, I must have missed something. Something. This looks like a boss arena, to be honest with you, the more I run around this thing. Hoping you would do something. What is that? Nice. Hmm.
Yeah, um, bit confused. to do this <laughs> don't hate me oh yeah four five four Cargo Manifest, Brax Shipping Company, Cargo Manifest, delivered to the Black Marrow, CO, Gelatin Street 13, item list, four steamer trunks, props, one sarcophagus, Egyptian coffin, one large wood crate, stage decor. Here we go. The address yes. where Jeremy first encountered Gelatin the dark Street. down there is looking much more bright. It will no longer allow me down there. Okay. Got him. I have the high ground, Anakin. Oh. Well, that worked out really well. Two rounds, that's it? Yeah. Looks like the fog cleared up. You think so? This is cleared up? I mean, I've been to... I've never been to New Orleans, but I've been to Louisiana. It doesn't look like this usually. 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 Let me guess. Front door is locked. The door is unlocked. It's too easy. so badly in there. I was like, nah. Yeah. Comes to the Pharaoh, though, Mike. You never know. Mm -hmm. Just running up some endless stairs. It's an SCP event. What's up, brother? Tell me what this is all about. No. Welcome, Detective. Welcome, Detective. To the greatest show this side of the Mississippi. Oh, you think so? No, the hotel. The Black Pharaoh. The ancient magician who lived a thousand lives and wore a thousand masks. I can see why you settled on calling him the Dark Man. Saves your breath. Hmm. So, you got scared by a stage magician. 
and now he's living inside your head. You can mock me, detective. And I will. You would be the crazy one to think his presence can be ignored. Well, I ignored him. Look where we are. Where are we? We didn't get to finish our last conversation, did we? You were about to tell me how to break the contract with the Dark Man. No, we can't. Sure we can. We're trying to loose on the world. So many innocent would die. Nah, they're fine. But there is a way to break out of the deal. There is. You offered me a way out. Steps to take. Sounds like he can't do What are they? You'll never find them. They're forever entombed in his sunken desert temple. Oh. Jeremy, I'm not your enemy. It's like going to the Tell store, Tell me where man. to go. How do I find the temple? How do I find it? No, we can't. I have to make this sacrifice. <laughs> God damn it, Jeremy. Did you just get pushed over I'm gonna save you. A frail... Don't worry. Man. Isn't he supposed to be, like, older? Carby, I'm not gonna lie to you, brother. You kind of suck. <laughs> like, what was that? <laughs> oh my How do you God. save someone who doesn't want to be saved? Don't save him. Well, he don't want to be no saved. To Looks like two. Me, backward C. The address. Shut up. <laughs> All, right, let's, let's. All right, two. <sighs> Problem. Okay. All right. Little one is me. So me. The two and then backward C's. Two backward C's. Still need to figure out. Okay, so the me is a beer goo. So uh, one, okay, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So eight, two, one, two, three, four, five, five. So eight, five, and then backwards these is two. Eight, five, two. Five two, no. Five two, I thought. Hmm. Yeah, that's the outer plate. That's the center plate. So maybe I miscounted. B two, backward C's. Okay. View it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, unless. Unless it's a Capricorn. What does that thing really look like? Okay, it's got a little squiggly thing with a tail. It's like a. A sideways C, but the M has got a thing on it. Yeah, no, that's definitely it. So, let me recount. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So, eight is the... Two. Okay. Right, so, yes, the furthest one out is two, so I got it backwards, two, five, eight. Two, five, 
Hey, there we go. All right, looks like a chair. And then a pharaoh's face. That's where I'm standing right now. And then something. There it is. There's the chair. Oh. Am I in the sunken temple desert? Sunken desert temple? The answer is yes. Ah. The air is a lot more arid here. Oh. Interesting. Desert temple. There I it is. Get down there. Just jump. You got it. Aim for the bushes. Oh my god, this is out here. Key item. Fantastic. The temple. The temple of Nefren Ka lies under our camp. Despite all efforts, that unholy site did not collapse, but sink beneath the sand. The pharaoh is long dead, his name meticulously stricken from all ancient writing, but the stagement for blood and terror remains. The temple is said to be lightless, built to harbor all the haunters of the dark found in the very depths of our universe. Calling on the gods meant creating a bridge between our world and theirs. The terrible Aldebaran of Taurus, the Black Sun, was seen as the most important star in the night sky because according to the Kitab al-Azif, it was said to be the home of that crawling chaos known as that. Through ancient mechanisms, it was said that the priest could open shafts channeling the light emitted by the strange stone called the Shining Trapezoid. Several streams pulled together above the Statue of Dark, Let's see, uh, do, 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 Statue of Dark, of the Dark Man, would then be sent through the space towards the Black Sun, a message to the gods. The gifts bestowed on the cinder are completely undocumented, but often assumed to involve a dark blood pact where souls are traded for malicious miracles. Oh, that'd be interesting. I'm assuming we're going to send him to the sun. Those enemies. Don't think so. Shouldn't have wasted that shot either. All right, where's the tie-off point, brother? There. Here we go. Here we go. Do you know how hard it actually is to? go down a rope. <laughs> it's not easy. Ah, oh, well. Crap. I guess I'm not climbing back out of this bad boy. Use the old temple mechanism. Yes, of course. Enemies? <sighs> okay, well, that was simple enough. Just shoot him. Shoot him. Hmm. 
appears to be a lens missing. carrier of sorts. Hmm. It appears as though I found the lens. <laughs> oh. Uh, lens crafted with unexpected precision and fitted with a tank. This one looks operational. Right into the eye. It worked. Hold tight, Sam. Don't really know what it does. Alright guys, well I lost track of time. I'm gonna have to end that there. Thank you for joining me today. I do appreciate it. If you enjoyed, leave a like would be a great review. And subscribing is a great way to stay today when I post. As always, I appreciate you taking the time to watch this, and I will see everyone in the next one. Deuces!